So the peer program actually started as a statewide initiative back in the 80s. Uh, there was an organization called the Teen Institute of the Garden State, and a lot of high schools started adopting what they were trying to teach, and so a lot of uh, schools had this and they called it TIGS. When I was in elementary school and we got to do activities with the peer leaders, I always thought it was so fun and I wanted to be able to do that. Peer is really for anybody who is committed to just making Old Bridge a better place. Um, a lot of what we do in class centers around team building, um, building positive communication strategies. I love my peer class. It's so fun and we're always laughing and giggling with each other. My favorite part of peer is my class and doing like planning birthday parties for everybody so that they always feel like so so this year our peer leaders are going to be working a lot with all of our other schools in the district. Um, every class gets to partner with a fifth grade from one of our elementary schools and they'll go down there. They do a lot of activities to help our fifth graders connect with each other, um, learn team building strategies, learn problem solving strategies. They'll get to work with our middle school peer leaders to kind of mentor them and help them run peer in their own buildings. Uh, so my favorite activity for peer by far has to be the peer retreat. Um, it's really the way that we kick off the entire year. So we're lucky to take all of our peer leaders away to Camp Mason. We have a two night overnight retreat. And during that time, it's just a nice opportunity for our kids to connect a little bit um, and to just do something a little bit different that they wouldn't normally get to do, obviously, here in Old Bridge. A fun tradition is going on the peer retreat and visiting the freshmen, the, fifth, the eighth graders. Not the eighth graders. Well, yes, eighth graders and the freshmen and the fifth graders.